Cyber attacks are evolving and hence we always need a better way to protect ourselves. Watch this video till the end as you are going to learn one of the widely used cybersecurity methods adopted by most of the businesses. But before we do that, if you're new to the channel, you can subscribe it now. Defense in depth. It's a cybersecurity approach that leverages multiple layers of security for the holistic protection. This approach reduces the overall vulnerabilities and mitigate the risk. This concept was initially uh, conceived by the United States NSA. There are three core parts, three core pillars, I would say, of defense in depth. The first part is physical controls. You see security measures that prevent these physical access to the IT systems such as security guard, uh, key guards, or maybe even lock door as well are part of the physical controls. Second, technical controls. It could be endpoint security solutions like antivirus solutions, endpoint protections, endpoint detection and response. These tools are used to protect the threats originating from your PCs, your servers, your mobile devices as well, right? It could be a patch management tools to keep your system up to date and address some common vulnerabilities as well. We can also have network security solutions. These are well-known solution as you might be knowing like uh, firewalls, VPN solutions and network access controls as well. We can also have IPS IDS to identify malicious activities targeted at our on-premises network as well. Next, we have identity and access management solutions such as single sign-on, multi-factor authentications to authenticate and authorize users and also protecting the access privilege accounts as well. Third is the administrative controls. The security measures consisting of policies, procedures it, the, that could be directed at the at an organization's employees or maybe the, their vendors as well. The example could be information security policies, the vendor risk management, third party risk management framework, or maybe cybersecurity risk assessment, or maybe it could be the uh, information risk management strategies as well. I hope that was useful for you. If you have found this video useful, then you should definitely enroll for my completely free cybersecurity masterclass course. After completing this course, you can build your own cybersecurity lab to practice and you will also be getting five steps to prepare for job interview. Four hours of a video, an official certificate of completion and an access to my cybersecurity community. Thousands of students have already found this useful and shared their experience. So what are you waiting for? Find the link in the description for the free masterclass now.